God's plan for man. One of the premier works by Reverend Finus Jennings Dake. I ran across this book way back in my Christian walk. Hadn't been saved too awful long. Uh, had gone through my uh, national Bible with the King James references that it in included. And then I also went to a Thompson Chain reference Bible and went through it. And uh, went through their chain. It's a very, very, very complete and good Bible. And then I ran across the Bible behind here, which is the Dake Annotated Reference Bible, 18th uh, printing. And uh, the notes were so many, the scripture references so many. I mean, it was just pretty much overwhelming. So I said to myself, you know, I've got to have a little some more help uh, to understand what's in there. And so I prayed to the Lord and I asked the Holy Spirit to uh, reveal a way for me to understand more. So it was at a camp meeting that uh, I ran across uh, a brother that told me about this book. So I ordered this book from uh, Dake. Bible sales at that time. It's Dake Publishing now. And of course the covers changed now. I think it's green maybe something other like that but it's still called the same thing. Uh, still has about uh, 1100 pages of uh, teaching in it but it has uh, a better index now I'm told. I may have to get a, a new copy. But this book uh, is well worn. It's very complete. I'll show you this on the inside cover where it's easier to read. But, uh, Brother Dake, I've never seen anybody like him. The ability to quote the Bible. You know, his nickname was the Walking Bible. You could ask him to start at any part of the Old or New Testament. Uh, in the King James. Not any other version, but in the King James. And he could uh, give you chapter and verse all the way through. From Genesis 1-1 to uh, Revelation 22. He's just fantastic. Uh, let's see. Uh, 1988. I've got a date on there, so it might be when I got this book. Uh, the book has been uh, been used incredibly a lot. Let's take this dust cover over. I'll lay it over to the side, and we see the uh, the book. Very well built book. Uh, well, it has to be to uh, last with me on it. Uh, hardback. Those are not, uh, they're scuffs. They're not uh, tears or anything. And I bought this at my Bible bookstore. My brother-in-law had this uh, Bible bookstore in Richmond, Kentucky. And uh, so I ordered it through there. And God's Plan for Man. For Man. Contain 52 lessons, one for each week of the year. It started out as a correspondence course. And each one of the lessons had questions that you had to answer and send back in. Uh, also had supplements that he sent out to it. Also his fantastic chart 
which uh, I have a copy of here and plan to make a uh, video on. Uh, a lot of people says, you know, Brother Dake has his own, uh, the Dake Company has its own uh, advertising, you know. Well, they do, but when you're a Christian and you run across something that's so extraordinary that you just want to share it with other people, that's what I'm about. I mean, you don't have to agree with everything that anybody teaches. I don't agree with everything Brother Dake teaches, uh, though it's very minimal. But, you know, any more than I agree with everything that uh, uh, Dr. Ruckman teaches or uh, uh, Jeffries or anybody else. Uh, but the Bible says, study to show yourself approved unto God. And the thing about Brother Dake is he never teaches anything that he can't give you at least, and this is written in here, at least two or three plain scriptures to prove it. So, the lessons break down in four parts. The origin of all things, God's historical dealings with man. Okay, this is dispensational. If you're not into dispensationalism, you know, Brother Dake is uh, not for you. Uh, but he is uh, very knowledgeable on it, and he shows that dispensationalism is the only way that you can truly understand the way the Bible works. Uh, present dealings with man and future dealings with man. Here is uh, the information. I've already done a review of the rapture and the second coming, I think, book. Notice that it's copyrighted and no copyright infringement is intended. It says you can give small doses, which is what we're doing here. Okay, it was a loose leaf set that uh, that was the original. Wouldn't mind running across one of those, but I haven't seen one. One thing you can't find in any of the used Bible stores is a Dake annotated reference Bible. You know, somebody told me you can find them for ten, fifteen, twenty dollars here and there, but never seen one. And I've looked for years, never seen one. I always have to buy mine new. <laughs> well, but, you know, it's worthy. I'm not saying it's not worthy, but now I would love to stumble upon one of those gems like I uh, did my Salem Curbing Bible. I got that Bible for $3. Uh, now, very inclusive. Breaks down into lessons. You can read this uh, print very well. Once again, it gives you the divisions of how the lessons are going to run. Now, of course, mine, you know, I mark my stuff. A lot of people don't, but I do. I don't think God minds. And it helps me. I've got a lot of sermons out of here. A lot of Sunday school lesson direction out of here. And, uh, you know, you got uh, Greek words and everything uh, given for everything that he uh, says to Hebrew. Uh, just a volume of work and everything in here I think is pretty much in the Dake annotated reference Bible but it's laid out different these are actually lessons laid out the way that uh, you know the Bible says precept upon precept line upon line uh, this is pretty much the way that brother Dake uh, 
gave uh, gave us to study in order to uh, understand the Word of God. Uh, now he was King James only. Uh, now his kids have gone New King James too, but now he was King James only. And on top of that, he was black letter version Bibles. He wasn't into the red letter. He said all the words in the Bible were God's words, so didn't stress a whole lot of importance to the difference because every word was divinely inspired. Let's take a note, look at this. The truth about the Holy Spirit. The deity of the Holy Spirit as a person of the Trinity, not just a nothing, but actual person. And he breaks that down. Divine names and titles are ascribed to him. Notice to him, the Bible says there's only two genders, male and female, because we're made in the image of God. Uh, now the back, now I think the new ones, where the new ones are different, I haven't really seen a new one, I may need to get one, but I just love studying this one, because I guess I've had it so long, and indeed I do, uh, uh, I do like my original date Bible, but I have, you know, about four of those large print and the standard I like the standard pull column better than any but here is a uh, poem in the back I don't know if uh, you can uh, see that or not maybe pause it or something other it's not my brother Dake but called the devil's last song and then your index to the lessons I think you'll find uh, that it'll be a very good study aid for you thank you for your time and prayerfully submitted thank you